Governor Doug Ducey signed a bill today to crack down on opioid abuse. This signing comes after a unanimous decision to pass the bill through the Arizona House and Senate last night. Cronkite News reporter Gabriel Gamino was there for the signing. And aggressive pieces of public policy we've seen in years. Exactly five days after calling for a special session, surrounded with Republican and Democratic leadership, Governor Doug Ducey signed the Arizona Opioid Epidemic Act into law. I want to thank all of our legislature. This was a unanimous vote for putting party labels and politics aside and getting this done. This law is going to do is to give public health, our health care professionals, and law enforcement tools to better combat the crisis. Dr. Kara Chris, director of the Arizona Department of Health Services, says the law provides protections for patients and for people reporting overdoses, as well as help for those who are addicted. It's going to allow people to be saved by allowing loved ones and friends to call using the Good Samaritan law. It's going to expand access to naloxone. It's going to help get people access to the treatment with $10 million and um, requirements for insurance companies to approve other treatments and alternatives so that people don't have to depend on opioids. At the Capitol, Gabriel Gamino, Cronkite News. There are some exceptions to the new law. Dosage limits would not apply to cancer, trauma, and burn patients, those in hospice care, and substance abuse patients. Also, doctors can extend existing prescriptions for patients dealing with chronic pain.